right? It's not too late. It's not too late to send a message to your mom. I'm sending a message to my mom right now, all right? I'm sending a message to my mom right now, all right? Just a happy Mother's Day. That's all you need, all right? My mom has not responded yet. I'm hoping that my mom will respond. Look, this is the most genuine message I ever send my mom. This is the first time. Like, I'm not even joking. The first time I ever write this to my mom, ever. What the heck? What did she just reply to me? My mom just wrote me back. And guess what she wrote to me? I was being all nice, happy Mother's Day. And she's like, Thank you. Did you get any letter in case got roadblock? All caps. What the heck? What's wrong with my mom? Why is she typing? Why is she typing all caps? Hey, what is up, guys? Guitaro here. Welcome back to another Brave Nine video. All right, today's video is not going to be really about Brave Nine itself, but more of the drama surrounding the harassment that I've been having for the last couple of days. All right, so I figured, you know, I've been doing a couple of live streams this past few days talking about this so I figured I would just update you guys of what's happening and what is this all about since a lot of you guys come to the live stream late and be like hey Kitara what is happening tell us more about this drama tell us more it all started approximately a week ago all right this is like seven to eight days ago there's this guy that approached me on discord right through the app he wants me to pull on his account as easy as that so I did a live stream a couple of days after, after we agreed, all right, everything is done, everything is settled, let's do it then. I told him the time and I'm like, all right, please, if you can try to be there, like just in case it didn't go smoothly, right? All right, I'm done, I'm done. Okay, uh, how do I do this? Let me log out from this account. We're gonna log into that guy's account, okay? We're gonna... Uh, Blank out everything so you guys can see the details that I'm about to put in. This is the email. Copy paste. Uh, it's uh, 6969 at gmail.com. And then this is the password. Okay. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Alright, someone go and ping Phoenix right now. Ping Phoenix right now. Yeah, I'm really trying to... Is he even in Discord? Well, he... so I tried to do the pull, everything. He did not show up. I got really upset, all right? You want me to put on an account? How can you not show up? Like I told him, I even did the live stream for him, right? And I'm like, hey, can you come online right now? I've been waiting, password is wrong. I told him, hey, you should have make sure it's correct before sending me, right? And then he says, oh, everything works fine. Uh, it's a Facebook account or whatever. Then I told him, no, you have to log into the game, not the Facebook, right? You, you can't give me, you have, give, you have to make sure it works. You can't show me this from Facebook. It doesn't make sense. Of course your Facebook account works. Of course it's your account. I'm talking about the game. Like you are giving me the wrong details. And then, all right, everything goes and he just say, okay, it doesn't show on Facebook. I did not know that. All right, he didn't know that, whatever. All right, first day didn't go as expected, unfortunately. I told him the important question is why? Why were you not around when I'm streaming? And then he said, sorry, we are in different time zones. Fair enough, fair enough. I told him, all right, Next day, can you please be around when I do pulls, just in case. I told him the time, exactly when I'll be streaming, and then, next day, we made sure everything is correct. He was there, alright, he showed up, finally. So I did the same thing, he gave me the details, I logged in. You know, this Google account thing, like, when you log in, you have to tap the number, right? This is like a two-factor authentication, so I asked him to tap five, tap five. Now I sent him a picture, asked him to tap 5, I press resend, and then the number changed 82. I asked him, hey, 82, fast, you gotta do it fast. If you don't do it fast, it will not work. And he's like, no, please wait, that's my device. I got really upset, alright? I'm not gonna lie, I got really upset. Like, why is he not getting his device ready? I feel like his phone is like, somewhere in like, a basement or something that he had to run there. I was waiting for him to get his device for I didn't receive anything. And then, you know, he said, I didn't receive anything, I get it now, try again, blah, 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 blah. I explained to him, I'm really sorry. I think you should have made sure to test this on your own. You should have taken this more seriously. All right, this is second day. And he expect me to have time to like waste on trying to log into his account. 
every single day and you know I even do a live stream just for him and he didn't show up right it didn't work out the first day and today's the second day and he's giving me excuse that okay he's using blue stacks he's never asked for this code before this is the first time because we're in a different country like of course of course that's how Google works why are you not getting your phone ready that's the question right like that is the part that doesn't make sense to me all right he said he felt terrible let's just make this work you can stream it tomorrow after that uh, I saw the code you told me to tap last time but it was too late I promise I will tap as fast as I can this time also I can check to trust your device so no more codes when locking next time just to be sure please it's my last wish like this happened when I was still streaming right so I'm like hey just just all right just, just stop man just stop I'm trying to get some rest just stop harassing so I thought everything could have ended right I thought everything was like full stop it ended right there all right he can just do his own pulls or whatever I don't even know how long it has it been like three to four three to four days or is it like six days or seven days but approximately a couple of days later Phoenix guy is back all right and this time I expose him on the stream all right guess what now listen I, I'm not someone that I want to cause drama against other people but I think this is too much he's like yo guitar rock can we do the pose today and then I'm like no I can't you know he always tell me that he's very busy with work and stuff so I thought he's working and stuff and then he's like oh guess what he's like yo guitar rock can we do the pose today I have a day off today thought we could just do this wow he took a day off today in in the mindset that we could just do this this is where the toxicity starts right I'm like I thought he was joking all right I thought he was joking I thought he's joking I'm like haha sure hey buddy it's not even funny how do you just casually take a day off and not tell me in advance and expect me to be free right like if you want me to pull on your account, there's no way you tell me this today. You gotta tell me yesterday, right? And then if I'm free, then you take leave. Like common sense, common sense. If you are a working adult, this is how you do things. Unless you are a kid, you are a twelve year old kid. Maybe it's different. Maybe you are a twelve year old kid. I don't know. Is this guy a kid? Maybe. Maybe he's a six year old kid. I have no freaking idea. All right. And and then the toxic gets real. The toxic gets real. All right. Guess what happens? I am here before the stream. Also, I am not trolling. If I was, I wouldn't put that much effort anyways. I got my Galana plus 9 thanks to you. Why would I want to troll you? Seriously? Exclamation mark. Right? He's like... I told him, because if you want me to put on your account, doesn't it make sense for you to tell me one day before? Or at least... I would say at least three days before, but at least one day before, right? That's why I explained to him, right? I just explained to him. Like, how can you take leave today and expect me to be free? It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense, right? It just doesn't. Maybe to some of you guys who are kids out there, it, maybe it makes sense. I don't know. And then, guess what? It got real. He told me... Okay, I, I was like, Yo, Phoenix. I don't get it, Phoenix. I don't get it, right? Why are you coming to this much effort to harass me, right? So I just told him, like, You have been harassing me every single day so i just i just type it there i just say hey i don't get it just pull yourself right i mean like i just say hey okay why are you harassing me just pull yourself so i finally found out what he wants i finally found out what he wants he said but i was hoping you do some fixes to my account so all the while he didn't want me to pull he wants me to fix his account for him, right? He wants me to fix his account for him. We have all looked at Phoenix's account before, all right? He has nothing. He played for three years and he has nothing. I told him, yo, listen, I hope I'm not too harsh here. I was just like, you don't even play the game. I look at your account and I know. Like we have seen his account before. There's no way. He played for 3 years and he only have like 4 plus 15 units. Yeah, so I just told him. Yeah, I will fix your account. Right? And then he's just gonna take a break from the game for the next 3 months. Anyways, so what's the point? And then, 
Wow, guess what's the response, guys? The toxicity increased. He told me something that a true Brave Knight fan would tell anyone. I found the game more fun to play lately. I am gonna stick with it this time for sure. Wow. Finally, he's a true Brave Knight fan. So he admit, previously he wasn't taking the game seriously. He literally admitted. And this time he will stick to the game like a sticky glue. He will never leave the game for sure, right? You should block that Phoenix guy. <laughs> a true Brave Nine fan. I like it. I told him a very simple thing. All right, gotta be real, right? Of course I would tell him, hey, if you have really been following me and watching my videos, I don't see why it's so difficult to fix it. I mean, at the end of the day, I make videos for everyone, right? For the Brave Knight community. Like, if you have any problem... Like, if you watch my videos, why is it so hard to fix? Leda Cry is broken now. Galenia is broken now. Like, why do you need me to pull on your account? Why do you need me to fix your account for you? And then... He went... From the scammer strategy... Phoenix is smart, alright? He's not stupid. He's smart. He's actually cunning. And I will tell you how cunning he is. He went with a compliment strategy. He went with a compliment. He went with, You're a big brain, Guitar Rock. I can't compete with it. You are so OP. Wow. He went with a compliment route from toxic to compliment. But guess what? It doesn't stop there. It doesn't stop there. He thinks he can just compliment me and be like, okay with it. I don't fall for this, alright? I don't fall for this. Right, at the end of the day, right, he's coming to this much effort, asking me to do this, that, 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 that. So I asked him, hey, all right, you really want me to put all this effort to help you in your account? And I told him, like, okay, what's in it for me, right? And then he's just like, I'm subscribed to your channel with the notification bell for three years. That's a long time. Three years is a long time, man. Three years. Some of you guys are like 69 years old by then, right? I always watch your YouTube videos. Also, these pools were asked by many people in your Discord server. Who? Which one of you guys asked for this post? Rise up your hands. And then, this video will make some, wow, will make some, some income, wow, some income for you, and maybe you will start some new category in your content, making account reviews. What? Many content creators do this. Wow. From Toxic to compliment and now he's lying for sure. Now he's lying. I just explained to him. Okay, if you are my subscriber, you watch my videos for three years. Why is it so hard to fix your... I, I don't get it. Why is it so hard to fix your account? If you have been watching my videos and be subscriber and bell three years or whatever shit, I don't get it. You don't even have to be subscribed for three years. Just watch my latest 10 Brave Knight videos. I'm pretty sure there's some meta relevancy thing that you... I make sure that I, he's not lying. All right, I make sure that he's not lying. So I asked him a simple question. Very, very simple question. All right, if he watched my recent videos, he should know this. I asked him, who's the top three magicians right now? Simple. He doesn't have to get them correctly, but at least he put some effort into answering them. All right, so anyone that watches my videos recently can at least get at least one of the person correct. Three top three magicians, like, come on. Livia has got to be there. Celia has got to be there. I give him like two minutes. <laughs> I give him like two minutes. And then he didn't even try to answer the question. He's like, yeah, I'm kind of focused on the patch, news, updates, related stuff. You saw my account. I am not following the meta. I don't even know every Merc name. Exposed. Exposed. He doesn't even play Brave Knight. He don't even know the mercenary's name. He doesn't know anything. We got him, guys. So he's just harassing me for the sake of harassing me. Alright? Some people watch with eyes wide but open but never use their brain. I really like to help you, Phoenix guy. Mr. Phoenix, Mr. Phoenix guy. Or girl. Or Lolly or Shota, whatever you are, Phoenix. If you are watching this, if you don't know any Merc's name or whatever, why don't you go and watch my videos 
to improve, right? I make videos for the meta, like who's strong, guides. So why don't you watch them? Like, I'm just being straight up honest. <sighs> this is where the toxicity starts. This is where we get to expose Phoenix for the truth. All right, guys, are we ready to expose this guy? He responded. He responded, all right? Here's the thing. We actually get to expose him this time. I remember when you did the card system reviews. Okay, okay. And then this one I remember. Edited, by the way. Edited. I think it's going to type something else, but he edited it. And then look at this. Look at this. Now he's telling something. The truth is my gaming time is limited. Okay, fair enough. Like two, three hours per day. That's when I am not busy. Also, my main game is War of the Visions. And guess what, guys? We're exposing him. What's his main game? War of the Visions and left Epic 7 this time. He's an Epic 7 player, all right? He's an Epic 7. Never trust an Epic 7 player harassing you because they will go back to Epic 7 eventually. And this time I will stick with Brave Knight. Sure. Sure. This guy is exposed. Alright, you're not gonna stick to Brave Knight, you're gonna go back to Epic 7 eventually. That's how it works. Yeah.